Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Valencia Anderson. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Friday, January 21st, 2022. Now it's time to relax and take a brain break. Now let's go to Scott for today's sports highlights. Thanks Valencia. Sports fans, welcome back to Sporting Legends. Today's edition is on the single most famous baseball player of all time, George Herman Ruth, who is famously known as Babe Ruth. This legendary left-handed pitcher was also mostly known for being a New York Yankees slugging outfielder. He started his career at 19 and in addition to breaking literally hundreds of records, he was a three-time World Series champion and had over 714 home runs, including three in one World Series game. That's truly extraordinary. One of Babe Ruth's best quotes is, The way a team plays as a whole determines its success. You may have the greatest stars in the world, but if they don't play together, the club won't be worth a dime. Personally, I love this sport, and I think you will too. Now let's go to Sonia for the lunch report. Thank you, Scott. Today's lunch is chicken nuggets, baked beans, crunchy veggies, diced pears, barbecue sauce, and your choice of milk. Students, do not forget to let your teachers know if you will be receiving lunch today. Bon appetit. Let's go. Back to Valencia. Thank you, Sonia. Scholars, FSA night starts next week. They're next week, Tuesday and Thursday. Tuesday is for grades 3rd to 5th, and Thursday is for grades 6th to 8th, and they start at 6 p.m. This event is, in, is for information in regards to the FSA coming up. I hope to see you there. Our March Already Challenge is on the go and it ends on March 16th. Students need to have 25 past math and reading already lessons to go to the glow party. Let's get our lessons done and get ready for this next challenge. I can't wait. The Fantastic Hero Store is now open. The store is open from 7.15 a.m. to 7.55 a.m. and it's in room 114. Have a look at this schedule to see when you will be able to attend. On Monday, it's the first and second graders' turn to go to the store. Let's keep bu building up those hero points. Patriots, pitcher retakes will be on Monday, January 24th. This is for the people who missed their chance to be able to take their pictures on picture day. It starts at 8.45 a.m. and ends at 10.30. It takes place in the gym. Try to look the best for the picture. Scholars, it is now time to let your vote count. Student government voting takes place today and the winners will be announced this afternoon. Here is a list of the students running. And now let's check out these campaign videos from your wonderful candidates. I'm Brianna Duque running for vice president and this is why you should vote for me. First of all, I'm the best candidate for this upcoming school year because I hope to replace old equipment with new and better equipment to use. Also, I would be the best candidate for vice president because I remember anything out of the top of my head. So anything you want and need for the school year will be kept securely in my mind. Lastly, I just want to say I represent excellent qualities to hopefully be your next vice president. I'm extremely dependable, smart, and creative. Oh excellent qualities if I do say so myself. Vote Brianna Duque for Vice President. As well as this new one said, 
all our dreams can come true if you have the courage to pursue them. Good morning, everyone. My name is Maya Barr. I'm in the sixth grade and I'm running for secretary of the student council. In the seven years I've been at this school, I've gotten honorable 19 times and sold my determination to complete any test that I'm given. You should vote for me because I will make an effort to be the voice of my fellow classmates and I'll voice their opinions for the betterment of the school. You should also vote for me because I'm extremely organized and I can finish any given task. And lastly, if I'm voted, then I'll always take my time to write down minutes, which if you didn't know, minutes are notes from a student council meeting. I cannot promise to be the best, but I can promise to try my best, so make the right choice and vote for me. Hello everyone. For the ones that do know me, I'm Angelie Walker. And for the ones that don't know me, well, I'm still Angelie Walker. I thank you all for taking the time to listen to me explain why I should be Vice President. As Vice President, I will dedicate myself to making sure that everyone can feel the embrace of the school spirit and have the opportunity con to contribute to it. I very much believe that every student has a say in our school and that every opinion matters and accounts for something. So as your VP, I will make sure that your opinion goes towards a greater cause. And I'll re represent you and everyone else, not just as students or voters, but as my classmates and my friends. Vote me, Angelie Walker, for Vice President for 2021-2022. Thank you. We wish all of our candidates the best of luck. Yo, it was good pictures. We're going to have an upcoming car wash for all sports coming. We need uniform balls and gear. Car wash is on January 29th, 10 p.m. to 2 p.m. $10 a car. Come on, let's make it as fast. Our Pence Patriots car wash is still on the way. It's on Saturday, January 29th from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. It costs just $10 per car wash. Tickets are sold on myschoolbucks.com. This event will be great to support our school's athletes. These cars deserve to shine like diamonds. Now let's see what the weather's going to be like today with David. Thank you, Valencia. Hey, Patriots. Today's weather is looking like 75 degrees Fahrenheit and rainy skies. We're experiencing a little rain, so make sure to beat the rain home. And other weather news, in Lima, Peru, a massive oil spill happened. Recently, the Tonga volcano erupted on an island in Peru. Waves from the eruption caused the spill. Over 6,000 barrels of black tar spilled. Some birds and wildlife were able to make it out before it happened. But a massive decrease in the wildlife occurred, so now fishermen are protesting. Thankfully, the spill is now under control. Let's hope that the fishermen can figure something out. Now let's go see Destiny for the birthdays. Thank you, David. Today's birthday boys and girls are Logan Maldonado, Abby Mejia, Addison Ramadar, Jalen Edward, Jaina Edward, Deja Hammett, Yeliana Recrero, Victor Veladares, Isabella, and Sofia Villatoro. And for our weekend birthdays, Zoe White, Jaleel Booten, Adesia McGowan, Camila Manzanero, and Sofia Montanez. Happy birthday! Now let's go to Chanel for Let's Talk. Good morning, Patriots. I'm Chanel, and welcome back to Let's Talk. Today, we are here with music teacher, Mr. Winselman. Thank you for being here. Hi. Let's start off with some questions. What, ha what do you do as a music teacher? What do I do as a music teacher? I try to educate the youth and make them a little bit more musical every single day. Little baby steps will become an opera singer eventually. That's great. How has music impacted your life? In a big way. I mean, my parents threw me into a lot of sports and to a lot of different things, but the only thing that really stuck with me is music, and I really fell in love um, the moment I touched the violin. That true connection, huh? Mm hmm What inspired you to become a music teacher? Wow, good question. Um, my internship was actually at a school that was similar to this one, and... Uh, there was a student that I remember, um, and I'll probably always remember, and uh, the student really made me want to become a teacher and really understood what I was teaching, and it made me feel good to know that I was making an impact. Do you have any hidden talents or interesting hobbies that you could share with us? Uh, yeah, I have a lot of hidden uh, talents, I guess. Um, I'm a, I like to uh, teach surf camps during the summer, so come check out Fort Lauderdale Beach. That's a shout out to my camp, Angley Surf Camp. So um, I like to surf, I like to do extra sports, fishing, when it's 
dealing with the water, it, I'm, I'm good. That's surprising. Great answers. Now for our lightning round. What's your favorite instrument? Cello. Would you rather talk to animals or speak all languages? Talk to animals. I'd rather speak all languages. Mm. It helps in the future. Okay. What's your favorite music artist? I do not. I do not have favorites. My favorite would have to be Whitney Houston. Okay, that's a good one. Dark chocolate or milk chocolate? Dark chocolate. Milk chocolate. Okay. Coffee or tea? Tea. Thank you for joining us today. Patriots, make sure to give them a warm welcome in the hallways. Now let's go back to Valencia. Now let's check out your amazing achievements with news around the school. Enjoy it! Awesome. Everybody say we're right back. That was amazing. Teachers, continue uploading any interesting photos or videos into the News Around the School OneDrive folder so we can highlight all of the awesome activities going around our school and in your classrooms. Patriots, here your PACS expectations represents. Present yourself positively. Act kindly towards others. Treat the school's environment respectfully and succeed at everything. Now for yesterday's trivia winners, congrats to Mr. Albides, Ms. Manon, Ms. Cavalita, Ms. Ayamdenkwa, and Ms. Newton. You had the correct answer to yesterday's trivia question, which was, how many chambers does the human heart have? The correct answer is four. Now, teachers and scholars, here is today's trivia question. How long was the longest carrot ever recorded? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. The winners will be announced on the next morning announcements. Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a fantastic Friday, and don't forget, this year we are all about fundamentals and forward focus. Have a great day and a fabulous weekend.